Hey guys, it's Ruben here with another Need for Speed Payback video guide. This one focuses on showing how to get all the billboards and gambler chips in the game. Now I know many of you have expressed you wanted to see this video earlier, but I got held up this week with family, health, and other things outside of YouTube. So it's a bit late, sorry about that, moving on. There are 30 billboards in the game and getting all 30 will earn you the Does Not Obey trophy. There are also a grand total of 100 gambler chips and getting them all will unlock the all-in trophy. Ramming through each billboard and collecting each gambler chip will also give you some money and reputation points so it's a good idea to collect them as you go throughout the game. Now I'm going to do a separate video guide for the derelict car parts because you find them in different areas around the map and I wanted to follow a specific order when collecting these so you can expect the derelict parts in another video. I'm going to have to mention that some billboards and gambler chips will require really fast off-road cars to make really far and high jumps. If you need the extra speed or airtime, buy speed cards with those specific perks. All gambler chips and billboards are accessible the moment you get your very first car from RAV, so you don't have to worry about beating a certain portion of the game to get them all. I will start my guide from the bottom right of the map where the city is. Then I will go counterclockwise going north into the red area then into the canyons. Then I will go towards the left into the mountainous region. I will be skipping the middle area as I will come to it in the end. Then I will go down the left part of the map into the desert and follow north in the middle of the map towards the airstrip area where you will find your first garage. If you follow this guide, you should end up getting all the billboards and gambler chips, so don't worry. Alright, let's begin. The first collectible in the guide is Gambler Chip 1, which is at the bottom right of the city, between two giant cylindrical structures. Gambler Chip 2 is located a bit west from the previous chip. At the location shown on the map, you will come to an entrance of a racetrack that has some construction going on. You will have a huge story related race with Natalia Nova's gang very late in the story here, so you should, you should know what it is. You will need to go off the ramp at the entrance to collect the chip in the air. Gambler Chip 3 is located north of the previous one. Go to the location shown on the map and instead of going into the tunnel, go left into the trail beside the tunnel. Follow the path and when you go off the ramp, you will collect the chip in mid-air. Gambler Chip 4 is located a bit southwest from the previous one. It is located under the freeway. Gambler Chip 5 is located very close by, just a bit west from the previous chip. It's at the back of a parking lot.
Gambler Chip 6 is located in a small courtyard between a couple trees, a bit northwest from the previous chip. Now, billboard number 1 is located beside the highway a bit northeast from the previous chip. Go to the location shown in the video and go inside the parking lot and follow the path shown here to get to the roof. From there, drive through the billboard to collect it. So the next collectible is Gambler Chip 7. From the previous billboard, follow the highway east and you will come to a plaza that is in front of a large hotel. The Gambler Chip is inside the small walkway leading to the hotel. Gambler Chip 8 is a bit south from the previous chip. Go to the location shown in the video and you can follow the path to the underground parking area of the hotel. Here go towards the right and the chip is hiding behind some fences. So the next one is Gambler Chip 9. From the previous chip, go south on the map. From the location shown in the video, follow the path around the loop and go towards the courtyard to find the chip in the middle. For Gambler Chip number 10, go a bit northeast from the previous chip towards the location shown on the map. From the road, go into the construction site and go inside a small tunnel which looks like a broken pipe and you can find the chip. So the next one is Gambler Chip 11. From the previous chip, go a bit northeast and you will be under a freeway. Go left into the small construction site and the chip is behind a small trailer. So the next one is Gambler Chip 12. From the previous chip, go west. This chip is in a patio area. Enter from the road by going into the hotel driveway and go left into the patio to find the chip in the back overlooking the freeway. So the next collectible is billboard number 2. From the previous chip head southwest to the location shown in the video. From the main road go right into the parking area. Drive off the parking lot and into the billboard to collect it.
Gambler Chip 13 is a bit southwest from the previous billboard. From the location shown on the map, drive into the small alleyway to collect the chip. Gambler Chip 14 is a bit northwest of the previous chip. The location is shown in the video. You can find the chip under the freeway. The next one is Gambler Chip 15. From the previous chip, go a bit northwest till you reach a barn house, as shown in the video. To the side of the barn, you can find the chip beside the fence. For Gambler Chip 16, go east from the previous chip till you get to the location shown in the video. Go into the pipe as demonstrated to get the chip. For Gambler Chip 17, right after you acquire the previous chip, take the other pipe right beside the pipe you just came in from and make sure to go fast enough to grab the chip suspended in midair. For Gambler Chip 18, from the previous chip go a bit northeast till you get to the location shown in the video. Here you can find the chip under a large pipe that is still under construction. For Gambler Chip 19, go northwest from the previous chip till you reach the location shown in the video. Here you will need to fall off the side of the freeway. Then you will need to follow the path till you drop down to the lower level. Turn around and go through the pipe on the right. Make sure to go fast enough when coming out of the pipe to grab the chip in the air. The next one is billboard number 3. From the previous chip, head east to get to the billboard. You will need to go behind the billboard into a parking lot. Make sure to build up enough speed when going off the ramp to hit the billboard. Remember, you don't necessarily have to go through the billboard entirely. As long as you make contact with it, it will get destroyed. So the next one is billboard number 4. Okay, now we are away from the city and heading north on the right side of the map. Head to the location shown in the map. From the road, you need to go off-road and drive off the ramp. Make sure to angle the car towards the billboard when coming off the ramp as the ramp does not exactly face towards the billboard.
The next one is billboard number 5. If you head west from the previous billboard and get to the location shown on the map, you will be on a road that is overlooking a billboard. Drive off the side of the road to hit the billboard. Without enough speed, this might take a couple tries. For Gambler Chip 20, head to the location shown on the map, which is a bit northeast from the previous billboard. From the road, you need to head left going off-road. Follow the path till you get to some small buildings. Behind one of the buildings, you can find the chip. The next one is billboard number 6. Head to the location shown in the map. It is a bit north from the previous trip. You need to build up some serious speed and make sure to use an off-road car unlike me. Also a car with a lot of airtime stat would help. Start from the road and head towards the ramp and boost off. Hopefully you land on the billboard. The next one is Gambler Chip 21. Directly after going through the previous billboard, go towards the barn that is beside the billboard. Inside the barn, you can find the chip in the middle. The next one is Gambler Chip 22. From the previous chip in the barn, follow the path northwest to reach a small shack. Behind the shack, you can find the chip. The next one is Gambler Chip 23. Again, from the previous chip, head north following the path. From the location shown on the map, go left off-road and boost off the ramp onto a higher platform to reach the next chip. For Gambler Chip 24, head west from the previous chip till you reach the location shown on the map. This might be the most annoying chip to get. You need to jump off a ramp to reach the cliff overlooking the chip. This is a location that has a derelict part. Follow what I do in the video to reach the cliff. Now this is the tricky part because you need to kind of eyeball where you're going to go off the cliff as to where the chip might be. Most of the times you will miss like I did. But with enough perseverance, you can grab it. Make sure to have good speed and a lot of airtime stats on your car. And also make sure it is an off-road car as it really helps. For Gambler Chip 25, head to the location shown on the map, which is a bit north from the previous chip. Here you will need to go left on the off-road path and jump off the ramp to reach a platform that has another derelict part. From this platform, you need to drive off the edge to grab the chip in mid-air. Another chip that might take a few tries to get.
The next one is Gambler Chip 26. From the previous chip, head east to the location on the map. This is really close to the garage you can buy on the right side of the map in the red region. So from here, go to the northmost part of the compound. The chip is beside some dumpsters. The next one is billboard number 7. Directly north of the previous chip you can drive off a ramp to hit the billboard. The next one is billboard number 8. From the previous billboard, head north to the brown region on the map, to the location shown in the video. It's right beside a gas station. From the road, drive off-road towards the right and make sure to go at really fast speeds as you'll need it to cover the giant horizontal distance between the jump and the billboard. With enough tries, you should smash through the billboard. The next one is Gambler Chip 27. From the previous billboard, head west to reach the next chip. You will need to drive off a ramp to reach a platform that overlooks the chip which is suspended in mid-air. You will need to drive off the edge with enough speed to be able to grab this chip. For Gambler Chip 28, head a bit north from the previous chip till you reach a small crossway on the map. There is a small overpass and you can find the chip underneath it. For Gambler Chip 29, head a bit northwest from the previous chip. At the location shown on the map, you will need to go right into the off-road area. Turn back once you have gone far enough. And now follow the path back and this time go off the ramp to grab the chip in the air. The next one is billboard number 9. Directly after grabbing the previous chip, make sure to jump off the ramp from the other side to be able to smash through the billboard. For billboard number 10, head west from the previous billboard till you reach a gas station close to the freeway. From the location shown on the map, drive off the ramp to smash the billboard. The next one is Gambler Chip number 30. From the billboard, head just a little bit west till you reach a bunch of trailers. Drive through the fences to find the chip beside one of the trailers.
For Gambler Chip 31, head south from the previous chip towards the freeway. When you get to the location shown on the map, turn right and drive off-road breaking through the fence. Underneath the freeway, you can find the chip. For Gambler Chip 32, head to the off-road path shown in the video. It's a bit north from the previous chip. Keep following the path till you come to a small metal tower. Beside it, you can find the chip. The next one is Gambler Chip 33. From the previous chip, head north all the way to the top right of the map to the location shown in the video. Here, follow the path I take to jump off the ramp and hopefully, you know, grabbing the chip. The next one is billboard number 11. Directly after getting the previous chip, go north to the location shown on the map. Drive off the ramp to smash the billboard. The next one is Gambler Chip 34. From the previous billboard, head to the small loop a bit southwest shown on the map. The chip is inside the parking lot. For Gambler Chip 35, head to the location shown on the map which is a bit west from the previous chip. You will need to drive off the edge of the road to grab the chip in the air. Make sure to use a fast car for this one. For Gambler Chip 36, head south from the previous chip. You will need to drive off a ramp at great speed to be able to grab this chip. Keep that in mind. For Gambler Chip 37, head to the location shown on the map which is a bit south from the previous chip. From here, follow the path north to find the chip around a small boulder. For billboard number 12, head west to the location on the map. Drive onto the off-road path as shown in the video to jump onto the billboard. The next one is Gambler Chip 38. After smashing the previous billboard, you can grab the chip by following the off-road path beside the one used to hit the billboard. Drive really fast for this one with an off-road car. This might take a couple tries as the jump can be really tricky.
The next one is Billboard 13. After collecting the previous chip in mid-air, you will hopefully jump to the other side to an elevated area beside the road. Here, if you take the left path, you can go off a ramp that will lead you to the billboard. The next one is Gambler Chip 39. Now go back to the elevated area, the place where you can access the previous billboard. This time take the right path and go off the ramp to collect the chip. This might take a couple tries if your car isn't good with getting air. For billboard number 14, head to the location on the map which is west from the previous chip. You will need to jump off the ramp from this location to reach an elevated area. You will need to keep moving as losing speed will result in your car not having enough momentum to get it to reach the billboard. This is really tricky and will take several tries. The next one is Gambler Chip 40. At the location shown on the map, a bit west from the previous billboard, you can find the chip behind some rock formation. The next collectible is Gambler Chip 41. From the previous chip, head to the location shown on the map, a bit southeast. Here you will need to drive off a ramp to grab the chip from mid-air. Gambler Chip 42 is at a gas station southeast of the previous chip. You can find this chip at the back corner. The next one is Gambler Chip 43. From the previous chip, we are now heading towards the mountainous area towards the left of the map. At the location shown on the map, you can find the chip on the off-road path close to some rock formation. For Gambler Chip 44, head south from the previous chip and at the location shown on the map, you can find the chip close to some rocks beside the road. For Gambler Chip 45, head to the location shown on the map. You will notice that the chip is suspended mid-air beside the road close to an elevated area. You need to follow the road through the tunnel. Once on the other side, take the path to the right. At the point where there is an off-road path, turn right into it. You will need to follow this path till you can jump off a ramp onto the elevated area close to the chip. This is also another area where you can find another derelict car park. You need to be careful here because you need to have the right amount of speed and the angle when driving off the edge of this elevated area to be able to grab the chip. Or 
you know, if you miss it, it might take several tries. And it's really annoying because you have to go through the entire tunnel, back to the off-road path, make that jump. I do advise being patient as this is a really annoying one and, you know, doing it multiple times can drive you crazy. So, you know, take your time with it. That was you? I thought I had rats again. You do? I had to fight one of them off for the last piece. <laughs> what, like a head-to-head -head duel? <laughs> exactly. Good thing that rat could have reached the gas pedal. For billboard number 15, head southwest from the previous chip till you reach the billboard shown on the map. You will need to take the road going left that will lead you to an edge that you can drive off to smash the billboard. This shouldn't be too much of a problem. The next one is Gambler Chip 46. At the location shown on the map, a bit southeast from the previous billboard, you can find the chip around the bend, close to the corner of the turn. For Gambler Chip 47, head further southeast from the previous chip to reach a small gas station. The chip is in the back corner of the station. The next one is billboard number 16. Directly after collecting the previous chip, take the path shown in the video to get to an edge overlooking the billboard. Drive off the edge to smash the billboard. The next one is billboard number 17. From the previous billboard, we are now going to go north to the observatory. Here, if you follow the path to the back, you can access the elevated area where you can drive into the billboard. The next collectible is Gambler Chip 48. Directly after smashing the previous billboard, go back to where you drove off the edge. Instead, go left and follow the path. Drive off the ramp at the end of the path to grab the chip in the air.
The next one is Gambler Chip 49. Go to the location shown in the video a bit southwest from the previous chip. Underneath the bridge beside one of the supporting columns, you can find a chip. For Gambler Chip 50, head southwest to the location shown on the map. It is a tourist spot which is overlooking the city at a very high cliff. Here you can find the chip beside the small brick shack. I'm guessing it's like a ticketing booth or something. The next one is Gambler Chip 51, which is directly after grabbing the previous chip. Go east on the path to the cliff and you can find the chip around the far corner of the loop. For Gambler Chip 52, head to the location shown on the map. It is a bit southwest from the previous chip. Here, if you drive into the freeway of the hotel or motel, whatever it is, you can find the chip in the middle. The next one is billboard number 18. Directly after grabbing the previous chip turned right, you can see a path leading to the billboard. Drive off the edge at full speed to smash the billboard. For Gambler Chip 53, head to the location shown which is a bit southeast from the previous billboard. You can find the chip at the bottom left corner of the small settlement. The next one is Gambler Chip 54. Directly after grabbing the previous chip, head east into the settlement. Pass the garage and drive into the small motel. The chip is at the far right corner of the motel. The next one is Gambler Chip 55. From the previous chip, head a bit northeast towards the gas station. You can find the chip inside the shed. For Billboard 19, head west from the previous chip and you will see a small church. Beside the church, there is a ramp leading towards the billboard. Just jump off the ramp to smash it.
For Gambler Chips 56, head to the location on the freeway shown on the map. It is a bit south from the previous billboard. Underneath the overpass, you can find the chip beside the supporting columns. The next one is Gambler Chip 57. Follow the freeway south from the previous chip till you get to the location shown on the map. The chip is in the middle of an off-road path beside some trees. The next one is Billboard 20. Directly after grabbing the previous chip you can notice the billboard appear on the map south of the chip's location. You will need to go further south on the freeway till you can turn left into another road. Follow the path back towards the billboard and drive off the edge at full speed to smash the billboard. So the next one is Gambler Chip 58. Right after smashing through the previous billboard, head southeast to reach a gas station. At the back corner, you can find the chip. The next one is billboard number 21. Directly after grabbing the chip, you can find the next billboard a bit east from it. Go around the road to the right and follow the off-road path behind the billboard. Make sure to use an off-road car for better performance. Drive off the elevated edge to smash the billboard. The next one is billboard number 22. From the previous billboard head a bit northwest to reach the location shown on the map. Here you can find the next billboard. Drive off the ramp to smash it. The next one is Gambler Chip 59. After smashing through the previous billboard, head back to the restaurant beside the ramp. In the patio area, you can find the chip. Just drive through the fences to get there. For Gambler Chip 60, head northwest from the previous chip and you will come to a location shown on the map. Here you will need to go through the off-road path and jump off a ramp to grab the next chip. This might be a tricky jump, so a couple tries and you should get it. The next one is billboard number 23. From the previous chip, we are going to go southeast to the location shown on the map. Here you can drive under the overpass. There is a ramp here which you can drive off and jump from to smash the billboard. Mm -hmm. 
The next one is Gambler Chip 61. Directly after smashing the billboard, head back to the ramp. Behind it and beside some supporting columns, you can find the chip. The next one is Gambler Chip 62. From the previous chip, head north to the location shown on the map. Follow the path that I take to get to the small ramp leading towards the next chip. For Gambler Chip 63, head to the location shown on the map. It is a bit east from the previous chip. The chip is on the off-road path. Nothing too troubling to get this one. For Gambler Chip 64, head to the location shown on the map. It is a bit southeast from the previous chip. You will need to drive off a ramp pretty fast to be able to grab the chip. The next one is Gambler Chip 65. From the previous chip, head southeast to the overpass. Underneath it, you can find the chip. The next one is Gambler Chip 66, which is directly after grabbing the previous chip. Head a bit east to the small building. In the back west corner of the building, you can find the chip beside some dumpsters. The next one is billboard number 24, which is directly after grabbing the previous chip. Go to the other side of the building to find a ramp leading towards the billboard. You will need to be really fast when going off the ramp to cover the horizontal distance to be able to smash the billboard. Use the road leading towards the back of the building to gain that momentum.
The next one is Gambler Chip 67. After the previous billboard heads southeast on the off-road path, you will reach a small residence. In the back, you can find the chip. For Gambler Chip 68, head to the location shown on the map. It is southeast from the previous chip. You need to drive off the edge here with a lot of speed to grab the chip in the air. Use an off-road car for better results. For Gambler Chip 69, head to the location shown on the map. It is east from the previous chip on the freeway leading from the mountain to the desert area. From there, go behind the trailers and underneath the metal structure to find a chip. The next one is Gambler Chip 70. From the previous chip, head northeast on the off road path. You will get to a communication tower. The chip is behind it. For Gambler Chip 71, head further northeast from the previous chip to see four wind turbines. The chip is located between the second and third turbine. The next one is Gambler Chip 72. Heading north from the previous chip will lead to a road. Here you can find the chip beside a house. Drive through the fence to grab it. The next one is billboard number 25, which is directly after grabbing the previous chip. You can notice the billboard a bit east from there. Go behind the billboard off-road and make sure you are using an off-road car for this. Drive off the ramp behind the billboard to smash through it. For Gambler Chip 73, head northeast from the previous billboard to the location shown on the map. This chip is suspended in midair. You will need to drive off the elevated cliff to its side and somehow land on the chip. This is probably one of the most annoying ones as it will take some experimenting to get the right speed and angle to land on it perfectly. It actually took me several tries, so good luck with this one.
For Gambler Chip 74, head north from the previous chip to the railroad tracks. The chip is just sitting there on the tracks. For Gambler Chip 75, head west on the tracks to get to the location shown on the map. The chip is close to a ramp. I made the mistake of being on the other side of the jump. No matter, use the ramp to get to the other side, then drive off the ramp on the left side of the tracks to grab the chip. For Gambler Chip 76, head a bit west from the previous chip to get to an abandoned train station. Behind the station and close to the broken down train, you can find the chip. For Gambler Chip 77, head northwest from the previous chip into the off-road path to reach a chip in mid-air. Drive off the ramp to grab it. For billboard number 26, head west from the previous chip to reach the next billboard close to a small rock formation. There is a ramp close by. You need some serious speed and also airtime stats, you know, the perks, uh, which come with the speed cards, on your car for this one. Make sure to use an off-road car as um, I can't stress this enough because you will need an off-road car to make this, to, to, to be able to grab this billboard. For Gambler Chip 78, head northwest from the previous billboard to the location shown on the map. Here you can see the railroad tracks crossing over the road on a small bridge. Get onto the middle of the bridge to find the chip. For Gambler Chip 79, head north from the previous chip to a small compound with a bunch of trailers. South of the compound is a ramp. Using an off-road car, drive off the ramp to hopefully grab the chip. The next one is Gambler Chip 80, which is a bit northeast from the previous chip. You will be reaching the solar panel energy reserve area. There is a ramp that you will need to drive off of to reach a chip. For this one, you need a lot of speed and a lot of airtime stat on your car to be able to grab it. Make sure to get enough distance to build your speed. Also use an off-road car for better results. This might actually take a couple tries. The next one is Gambler Chip 81, which is directly after the previous chip. Drive north into the complex to find the chip in the middle of the area. The next one is Gambler Chip 82. After grabbing the previous chip, head a bit northeast to the location shown on the map. From there, drive off the ramp to grab the chip.
Yammer Chip 83 is actually close by from the previous one. Head to the small loop shown on the map. Drive off the solar panel to grab the chip. For billboard number 27, head east from the previous chip to the location shown on the map. Here you will need to go off-road behind the billboard to an elevated area and drive off the edge to smash the billboard. Off-road cars really help here. For Gambler Chip 84, head southeast from the previous chip to the location shown on the map. There are a lot of wind turbines here. At the location that is marked on the map, you can find the chip. Drive through the fences to grab it. For Gambler Chip 85, head a bit southeast from the previous chip to reach the location on the map. Here you can find the chip behind the building. The next one is Gambler Chip 86. Now this is a special one. Head southwest from the previous ship to the location of the small easter egg, the crash landed UFO. I made a small video for it earlier but the main reason you are here is because there is a chip on the UFO. Too bad we can't fly that ship, it would have been really cool. For billboard number 28, head south from the previous chip to get to the billboard location shown on the map. This one is simple, just drive off the ramp to the side to smash it. Gambler Chip 87 is at the location shown on the map, where there is a ramp. You will need to use an off-road car and drive off the ramp at high speeds to grab the chip. The next one is Gambler Chip 88. From the previous chip, head east to another ramp leading to a chip. Same drill. Drive off the ramp at high speeds to grab the chip. Yeah, baby. So the next one is Gambler Chip 89. From the previous chip, follow the off-road path south to reach a small overpass. Underneath it, you can find the chip. The next one is Gambler Chip 90, which is a bit northeast from the previous chip, where you can find an abandoned warehouse. The chip is inside. The next one is Gambler Chip 91. From the previous chip, head northeast to the airstrip. At the location shown on the map, drive off the ramp and onto the plane hull to grab the chip.
The next one is Gambler Chip 92, which is directly after grabbing the previous chip. Head into the middle of the hangar beside the broken plane hull to find the chip. Gambler Chip 93 is after grabbing the previous chip and coming out of the hangar. Drive off the ramp in the small hangar northwest to grab the chip. The next one is Gambler Chip 94. Going east from the previous chip you will come to the first garage you get introduced to in the game. To the right of the entrance of the garage is a plane. The chip is located in front of the plane to its left. For Gambler Chip 95, head north from the previous chip to the location shown on the map. This is in front of a huge mansion. Drive into the driveway of the mansion to find the chip. For billboard number 29, head north from the previous chip to find a ramp close to the billboard right beside the road. Drive off the ramp to smash the billboard. For Gambler Chip 96, head southeast on the off-road path from the previous billboard to reach a small shack. In the back of the shack, beside a tree, you can find the chip. The next one is Gambler Chip 97. From the previous chip head east to the location on the map, under the overpass in between the two supporting columns is the location of the chip. The next one is Gambler Chip 98. Follow the road back west from the previous chip and you will come across the chip behind some trailers. The next one is Gambler Chip 99. We're getting really close here. Follow the road back west once more from the previous chip and you will notice a billboard. Beside it is a ramp on an elevated cliff. Drive towards the ramp but before going off the ramp, look inside the small barn to find the next chip. Billboard number 30. Well, you guessed it. 
right after collecting the previous ship, just go off the ramp beside the barn to smash the final billboard. And that should be it. All 30 billboards earning you the Does Not Obey trophy. Nice job, guys. And last but not least, the final Gambler Chip, Gambler Chip 100, which is located a bit south from the previous billboard. At the location pointed out on the map, you will come across a small house that has a truck parked beside it. Drive to the back of the house to grab the final Gambler Chip. That should earn you the all-in trophy. It kind of sucks because you only get money and rep points for collecting them. I kind of wanted like a super special car for grabbing all 100, um, but it is a huge disappointment really. But well, that's it guys, all 30 billboards and 100 gambler chips are now yours. Hopefully this guide helped. I know it's a bit late, but better late than never, right? Hopefully. I spent quite a while making this as it took some time to grab all these collectibles again on my friend's account. I wanted the video to feel authentic, so I went and started a new game on my friend's account on my console and got them all again. Hopefully this video helped you with the tricky collectibles and you can expect the derelict cars to go up soon as well as the activities I'm working on them it's just taking some time to capture some footage that's all I have a lot going around you know I'm doing Need for Speed I'm, I've got another game in and I'm also playing my Pokemon game on the 3DS uh, there's a lot to juggle around I'm trying to get this done as quickly as I can but um, your support is what keeps me going guys so thanks a lot that's it for this one. If you guys liked or found this video helpful, drop a like to help me out. And please do rate and share this video whenever you get a chance and is much appreciated. For all the newcomers to the channel, welcome. Enjoy your visit to the channel and consider subscribing to stay tuned to more guides and game content. Also helps the channel grow. I'll see you guys next time and as always, take care.